Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, this week I've been pretty busy, so I'm delving into the archives and showing you a project that I shot last year with the Good Coffee Cartel. Uh, really fun project. They cycled 100 miles for a cup of coffee. Uh, so, hope you guys enjoy, and I'll see you in the next one. So how far is it? It's about 100 miles. Well, how far would you go for a good cup of coffee? There's a huge crossover between people who love cycling and people who love coffee. We're a group of those people ourselves. We thought what better way to celebrate that than to get together and ride from Glasgow to Castle Douglas to see one of our wholesale customers who runs a beautiful bike shop called Studio Velo. And in that bike shop, they serve beautiful coffee. The cartel magic. I probably don't want that in there, but <laughs> yeah, maybe you do. Ah, shit, we still need to ask Courtney. Courtney. Yeah? Uh, are me and Tony okay to go for a coffee down at Studio Velo? We're going to cycle. You're cycling? Uh-huh. How far is it? Just about 100 miles. Can you cycle that far with those tiny legs? Uh, well, that's body shaming, first of all. Yeah. But no, the answer's no. Okay. But we're filming it, so I feel like there's an extra level there. I feel right. like we'll get there. Get some promo, though. Get some good out of it. All right. Yeah, we'll get some promo. Mm -hmm. No problem. But you think yes? Sure. Yes. Cool. Yeah. At least Fine make time. me a coffee before you go. <sighs> Tony! We're on. <laughs> 100 miles. 160 kilometers. The first task Getting the fuck out of Glasgow. <laughs> these are like, uh, if you buy a real pair of these, they're like 150 pounds. 11.99. <laughs> eBay. Give me some cock on the side rather than cock. Oh no. Eventually we got out of the city and hit the countryside. Super smooth roads, sun shining, meeting new friends. But like Courtney said, it couldn't all be fun. We had to do the promo. Hi, do you ever get tired on your long rides? Then you should try Bronco from the Good Coffee Cartel. <laughs> promo, done. <laughs> With the first one take wonder out of the way, we continued the journey. We were flying. Look how fast we're going. I'm actually a wee bit faster than Tony. But that didn't last long. Because that's when the hills started. I'm just in my own wee pain cave. Yowza! Come on, legs! Feeling it, Feeling it now. Tony, not so much. I'll grab onto the car for a wee lift. And he's now the abandoned man left by the team car. They're pursuing glory up ahead. And yet, it is the young man, or the not so young man from Perth. Many people have written him off in his cycling career. They said, you can't do this. And I say to them, I'm still going to do it. Here comes something for the fans. Alejandro Valverde, rolling back the years. Fucking hell. That kept coming. Fuck. Halfway. This will be in, this will definitely go into my top three rides in terms of uh, roads, fun, speed. 
Okay, well, is this good for uh, get, maybe get the wind farms in the background? You ready, Craig? This is one take. One take. Hi. When you're out on a tough ride, you need refreshment. That's why Rap Scallion, dry lime or rhubarb. Raw ingredients, natural flavor. Rap Scallion. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice descent, I think. Yeah, it looks good, doesn't it? This may be a wee drone job. Do you think, if you're up for it? If he's a slightly cheating, huh? Next, we were on our way to link up with Gareth Montgomery, two time Commonwealth cyclist and now owner of Studio Velo in Castle Douglas. What's the descent like? It's alright, it's quite nice, nah, it's quite open, sweeping. Just remember, Gareth, you've got 90k in our legs already, <laughs> so you're, you're Commonwealth calibre. I'll strip him, strip him across. <laughs> Ah, the road's stunning once you get over this. Yeah. It's a nice valley all the way down. In essence, this is what the good coffee cartel is all about. It's what we've always wanted to do, which is bring people together through a shared appreciation of coffee and other things. In this case, cycling. But it could be anything, whatever you like. We just want to bring people together. About 85 miles in, I got a phone call from one of our long-time customers who had moved down this way a few years back. I'd seen what we were doing and wanted to join us for a bit. Jay Bonner, how you doing? We have just come onto the road from uh, Monny Ive. Oh, fantastic. All right, man. It says he's 300 meters away. I sort of knew it would just all come together. Look at that for timing. <laughs> Perfect, man. How are we all? Good, how are you? Very well, good to see you. Good to see you, boss. It's been way too long. What's happening? What do we do? What do we do? We What's the. <laughs> Hello. Tom, we reckon we've got like 30k to go. Lovely. Well, this road is an absolute dream. Because it's all downhill? <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm praying for. How are the legs feeling? Terrible. Yeah? We really had a. Actually, the last like 20k have been great. Before that, I was in a pain cave. So that's tough, the way you've come over. Tell me about it. <laughs> These boys are just so good. You're on for home. All right, man. Let's do it. Keys. And I did like 10 keys from the house as well. So. <laughs> and a couple of wrong turns. And a couple of wrong turns. Well, they added to that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, I bet you, you get that nice wee tan line. Something for the fans. What's up, wee tour?
I actually really love that last 15k. Like, because it was a few punchy wee like rollers, and then the last punchy wee climb. But it's just like it makes such a difference when you, even if you're not flying, when you, if you feel like you're flying. Like I was kept looking every time I looked down, we were doing like 40k now. Yeah. Absolutely zoom I really enjoyed the descent off the men of past. Oh, yeah, it's like riding three by three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's my favourite. 100 miles in the bag. The longest distance I've ever ridden. Probably the most memorable cycle I've ever done. Simple pleasures, isn't it? Riding bikes, drinking coffee, surrounded by your pals. Pancake sandwich, also known as a pangwich. And it's got jam in it, so it's a jam pangwich. Won a few sprints against Tony. Let's get that on record. Yeah, this is the perfect illustration of how coffee can bring people together. Four people who, in another timeline, would never have met, cycling 100 miles together. <laughs> That's my sign off. Is it about 100 miles? <laughs> <laughs> is it about 100 miles? <laughs> <laughs> it's about 100 miles. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing even funny about what you're saying. Hey guys, thanks for watching. A little bit of something different this week. Um, if you liked it, hit the like button, leave a comment down below to tell me what you think, and oh yeah, hit the subscribe button, wherever that is. Uh, really appreciate it. Um, and I hope you enjoyed this delve back into the archives and I'll be back with more content next week. Cheers guys, see you later.